Hey everyone, I'm Tosh and I'm here to show you how to apply Dark Swan's Secret Lash Clusters for an effortless lash extension look from the comfort of your own home. Dark Swan's Secret Lashes have a super thin band making them very comfortable to wear under your lash line. And each box has an option of a short or a long mix or you can opt for the same size in one box allowing you to create a super customized lash look. To start, you're going to want to gather your lash essentials, which are lashes, lash glue, and lash applicator. I will be using the style Secret 03 Feather in the long mix, which has sizes 10, 12, and 14. The box of lashes does come with a mini lash adhesive, which is great for beginners. I'll be using their It's On Pro Lash Adhesive, which is longer lasting, but it's still gentle. I'll also be using the Lash Precision Applicator to apply the lashes, as well as the Pro Tweezers to help remove the lashes from the tray. And last but not least, I would highly recommend adding the It's On Pro Lash Seal and Protect to your lash collection, which helps get rid of any stickiness, and it also helps extend the wear of your lashes. There are two methods for applying the lash adhesive. You can either dab a small amount to the root of your natural lashes, or you can apply a thin layer to the lash band of the cluster and then swipe that cluster a few times across your natural lashes to coat your natural lashes as well. Combining methods one and two may create a better hold. To remove a cluster from the tray, grab your tweezers and holding the cluster at the base, gently lift upwards. Apply the cluster under your lash line. You do not want the cluster to touch your waterline as it can irritate the eye. You also don't want it too far away as it can create a gap when you look down. Now grab your next cluster and repeat the same steps. And it is as simple as that. Beautiful lashes that can last from three to five days from the comfort of your own home. If you do experience any stickiness from the glue, grab the sealant protect. I like to swipe some of the sealant to the inside of the lash applicator and then go ahead and pinch the clusters to my natural lashes. This way, not only are you securing the lashes, but you're also making sure you apply sealant to both the top and the bottom. You can also apply the sealant by dabbing it along the base and to your lower lashes if you have any stickiness there. You can also reapply the sealant after you wash your face to help with longevity. Oil is the enemy of lash clusters and lash glues, so to remove them, you're going to want to grab an oil-based eye makeup remover. I have one here that's kind of a dual phase eye makeup remover formula. You want to give it a good shake and then also grab some cotton rounds. Simply soak the cotton round with some of that eye makeup remover. Place that soaked cotton round over your lashes. Hold it there for about 30 seconds or so so that the oil in the eye makeup remover has time to disintegrate and loosen that lash glue. And after about 30 seconds, wipe downward and the lash clusters should slide right off. Repeat this step until all of the clusters are off. And those are the basics to lash application and removal. Dark Swan of Denmark makes it so easy to get beautiful lashes from the comfort of your own home.